In this example, we're going to create a project where we use the live option. With this option, we capture video through the camera and we can either tag events live or we can just capture the video and tag our events later. Once again, we begin by clicking on the plus sign in the My Projects window. Then we give our project a name and then select the tag template that we're going to use for our project. And this time when choosing our video source, we're going to select the live option. A message will appear telling you you've selected the live record option. Then click on the done button. Click on create and your list of projects will be shown again. This time the black camera record icon will be shown for your project. Open your project and the new focus window will appear. In your video window, you'll see the view from your camera. In our example here, we're obviously just videoing a white background, but the action you were seeing through your camera would be shown on the video screen. You will notice that your tag template has appeared on the right hand side of your screen as before. However, this time, a record button has appeared beside your video controls. You're now ready to begin recording. You're videoing your action and when you're ready, press the record button. The Focus app is now storing your video on the iPad, ready for use. You can tag events live while you're recording. In our example here, we've just got one category in our tag template. If something of interest happens, you just touch the buttons and your event is entered. We can see that as we enter events, they're being added to our events list. Once you've entered all the events that you're interested in, press the record button and the recording will stop. Your video will then be saved onto your iPad, ready to be reviewed or for you to add additional events.